Hi, welcome to another video on my fragrance journey. So in this video, I'll be looking at a Ferragamo bright leather. So it's from that uh, Salvatore Ferragamo line uh, with the leathers. So this one is bright leather. So it's a travel size that I picked up at, you know, my recent, um, you know, trip to the um, um, fragrance sale, the annual fragrance sale, the ASCO fragrance sale. So 30 mils, um, and man, was this a bit of a surprise, you know, so I'm very interested in this line. I've got the intense leather, I've tested the original one, very green, and you know, the leather note there, I'm not quite really sure about, but for now, at the moment, I think this is the best, you know, this is the best for now. So I've tested the original, I don't have it. Um, but I've got the intense leather, um, as you've seen in one of the review videos. So this is a 2022 release. Um, it followed hot on the trails of the spicy leather, if I remember correctly. Um, but it was it was like very close to one of the other releases from that brand. So yeah, um, the perfumer on this is Antoine Mersando. And you know, it's a leather scent, it's an EDT. So it's got a very fresh, bright opening, bergamot, mandarin, orange, grapefruit, very fruity. And then they've got a white leather note here. Never seen it before, but they call it a white leather note. So it's that white leather, a rosemary, basil. Um, so it's got aromatic vibes going there, herbal type of mix. And then the base, you've got cedar, patchouli, musk. Very, very, very beautiful smelling um, fragrance. Um, like I said, it's part of the Fairy Gamma Man line. Um, so you've got that one. You've got the intense leather. And then you've got the spicy leather in that line. Those are the, uh, some of the flankers. So performance, I would put it at around, for me, surprisingly enough, despite it being so fresh and light, um, the performance on this has been very, very good. So um, between six, seven hours. And one of the other days when I was testing it, um, I actually did a, a, a gym session and, you know, it started coming alive again. So it's definitely one of those built for the warm summer, spring type of weather for us down here in the Southern Hemisphere. Um, so beautiful, beautiful scent. The projection, very light but people can feel it for at least the first three hours or so three to four hours and then it pretty much becomes a skin scent or it waits for that heat to start generating it and you know making the scent uh, pop you know so in terms of usage um this is definitely something that will work as an everyday scent um, so as a daily signature definitely work and then age groups, this is something that guys in their early 20s up to their 30s can wear pretty, you know, effortlessly. You know, it's not one of those very complex type of fragrances or very difficult to pull off, like I said. Um, very, very fresh. So I'm definitely um, looking forward to getting a bigger bottle. Um, I don't have the... A bottle of the intense leather here so definitely worth getting a bigger bottle so i got the travel size you know I, I was busy doing hauls and um i think it only came in this size so hence i got you know um in this size um so in terms of pricing um the pricing i think this is one of the much more affordable from the from the line so definitely with a pickup not too expensive um i think a 50 mils you can pick up for around a thousand four hundred um so not bad around about 40 45 dollars um so not bad at all definitely something you can pick up a scent that you can it's 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 um accessible i would say and then um final recommendations it's a definite yes. It's a definite yes. This is one of the best from the line so far. I haven't tested the spicy leather as yet, but definitely this is from the man and the intense that I've, you know, put my nose on. This is by far the best. So the leather note here is not very aggressive and animal. It's very fresh light. 
So even if you don't like leather scents or those animalic scents, it would, you could definitely pull this off. So highly, highly recommended um, Ferragamo um, from uh, Bright Leather from the House of Salvatore Ferragamo. Um, definitely with, you know, getting the full bottle, not the 30 ml travel size, but definitely 50, 100 mils, definitely with it. Nice, fresh leather, leaning type of scent, but, you know, an acceptable leather, I must say. Um, very much a an entry level, you know, every man type of leather, not very aggressive. Very, very nice. Nice, nice scent. Fresh opening. Um, the leather in the midday and then mask patchouli cedar perfectly done. A simple note breakdown, yeah. Highly, highly recommended. Ferragamo bright leather. With that said, please like, subscribe, leave a comment, share the video. Till next time, over and out. Peace.